In our daily life, vacuum technology is everywhere. It is needed for the production of eyeglasses, smartphones, DVDs, jewelry, food and beverage packaging. But what is this condition that scientists call nothingness anyway? And what is the point of having a place that doesn't contain anything? To answer these questions, FIFA Vacuum has developed its vacuum experiment case. This case is designed to foster interest in vacuum among young scientists of tomorrow. It contains everything that is needed to carry out straightforward and exciting experiments which get children and youths enthusiastic about nothingness. The comprehensive experiment set can be used at school, in student labs, or at special events. It was developed by young employees of Pfeiffer Vacuum in cooperation with educators of the Association of German Engineers. A detailed instruction manual provides teachers and tutors alike with the necessary background knowledge to carry out and explain the different experiments. The easily transportable experiment case contains a complete experimental setup and a vacuum pump. It also contains various utensils which everybody knows from their daily life. They are used in different experiments and help explain the topic of vacuum and its physical characteristics. So youngsters find out for themselves how vacuum affects them in our daily life. With the aid of our vacuum experiment case, we're able to carry out experiments that are easy and vivid. In this way, we try to counteract the decreasing interest in natural sciences and techniques. While developing this experiment case, we paid attention to the ease and practicability of the experiments. Children should be able to carry out the experiments themselves to encourage their personal initiative, so we can illustrate complex physical processes to the children. With the experiment case, up to eight vacuum phenomena can be explained. For example, balloons, shaving foam, as well as chocolate and classic marshmallows can be evacuated. What happens to them when being under vacuum takes many young scientists by surprise. Also, the question of how vacuum affects a piece of fruit is being answered. Of course, all groceries can be tasted by the children afterwards. In a self-experiment, they get to know what happens to water in a vacuum. And they also learn which of these phenomena is used by modern industry to manufacture products which children and adults know from their daily life. We carried out cool experiments with a thing called... Mm, what's it called again? Vacuum. We, this was my favorite experiment, inserted a banana inside a bell jar and added a thermometer. Then we extracted everything. This made the banana get colder, which I really liked. Afterwards, we were even allowed to eat it. The manual that comes with the experiment case explains the physical backgrounds and basics of the findings. In addition, young Pfeiffer Vacuum employees are available for assistance or as investigators. I absolutely enjoyed it, and also the children liked it very much. They were absolutely thrilled. The most popular experiments were the ones with the banana and with the marshmallows. Even at home, children talk a lot about it. Parents came to us and told us happily how enthusiastic their children were about the experiments. As there are so many different ones inside the case, we have many ways of explaining the issues to the children. In fact, I believe everybody understood the content very well. The success of the vacuum experiment case is overwhelming. It is equally popular with research institutes, schools, holiday camps, and student labs worldwide. Many of these facilities have already ordered their own personal case. Not only children, but also adults learn and teach with the experiment case. It is a practical addition to the normal lessons as being used at events and trade shows of Pfeiffer Vacuum. Also, public institutions use it for their educational programs. This very special topic was also new to me, so I attended one of the sessions as well because I wanted to know everything in detail. The experiments, the ones with the groceries, as well as the ones with air and water, and how it all works. What happens with this nothingness, and why, for example, chocolate marshmallows explode, or why water first boils and then freezes. These things are not only fascinating for the children, but also for me as an adult. Of course, I already have some ideas of how to integrate the vacuum experiment case in our pedagogical work.